guys, Patty here. Just wanted to share a little tip on how I make my smoothies. So I do have a blender, um, and sometimes I use a shaker cup too. But my all-time favorite thing is the immersion blender. It's this thing here, which a lot of people use them for like um, soups and things like that, but I use these for my smoothies. So I'm gonna show you how easy this is. If you have one of these, you can get it at Target or Walmart for like, 30 bucks, I think. Um, I actually left mine in Florida when I went to go see my sister and went out and bought another one because I couldn't wait for it to get milk back up to me. I use it that much. If you're using almond milk, you're gonna make sure you get the unsweetened almond milk so it doesn't have any sugar added. So what I do is I put about a cup in there and there is a thing on there to where you can see. Okay, so you do about a cup of almond milk and then I do my scoop of Shakeology. The best thing about this is that it's less cleanup time. A half of a banana with ice and water. Okay, so I put like um, probably about six ice cubes in there and then water. And then, easy part. This is the first time I've used this one, so hopefully it doesn't fall apart on camera. Just to make sure you get all that goodness. And then this is the best part, you guys. Yay! And this is all you have to wash. You don't have to clean out your whole blender. I make it, I make a large portion. I make it so it's not like crazy chocolatey if it's just a little amount. But I also just want to make sure it's filling me up. Hope you guys are having a fabulous night and a great week. And for those that did not see my post the other day, we are continuing on beyond three weeks. So if you want to continue on, it's great. If you don't, no big deal. But it's a 60-day devotional, so we decided to continue it out through the year. So here's my thing. If you haven't been on track, get on track tomorrow. Get on track tonight. Get on track right now. Don't worry about having to start on a Monday. That's what we were talking about in this devotion. It's a, it's a lifestyle thing. So just continue on and do your best each day. Plug it away and just keep staying connected and let us know how to help you.